see what's going on for January 13th, 2022. Yeah, Queen of Michael. So this is the kind of thing where try to notice. Now, some people just don't have the capacity to understand that when they feel slighted by something, they think it's the other person that has caused them irritation or pain or whatever. When in fact, maybe the person was just speaking the truth, which is what the Queen of Michael card feels like. <laughs> There's a lot of truth speaking coming forward. This is that sort of thing. I was giving the example, I believe in the weekly where people will criticize me on this channel because I lay things down. Well, their egos are very fragile. They don't, you know, they have to be just told how wonderful they are. And if you say, hey, there, there's a, a thing here that maybe we want to look at and work on, they take offense to that and say, she's terrible and they start projecting, right? So it's that kind of thing. Try to catch yourself if you hear something you don't want to hear today. And you know it's true, but you still want to fight it. <laughs> Try to have some wherewithal. Try to catch yourself and go, okay, is that fair? Is that fair to, uh, you know, withdraw from the truth just because it's uncomfortable? All right. And it's not going to help you get any further if you do that. Brilliant, self-reliant, insightful humor. So somebody is coming to you today who is this person? And they're giving you a blessing. You see these yellow roses? These are blessings blessings by maybe it's somebody who says hey do you know that you could be doing this career hey don't you believe in yourself hey you're really creative and beautiful why aren't you out there doing it you know like doing this kind of career or doing this project or why don't you come join us at this whatever party <laughs> like whatever the deal may be but somebody comes forward and you might be so deeply ingrained in your belief system about yourself that you don't take this seriously or you Maybe your ego is so wounded and your ego is so fragile that, I mean, I've had people huff off in the comments just because, okay, this is not even talking to me by, because <laughs> they're the only ones that exist in the world, I guess, right? So it says, you know exactly what to do. The benefit of experience, a time for your career rather than relationships. Eh, you know, again, I think this is more about um, somebody coming forward and, and offering you a truth. You may or may not want to hear it or you may not believe it, but definitely it's, it's check yourself time. If someone's giving you feedback, if someone is coming to you and saying, hey, you know, in this scenario, this is how you're coming off. This is how people are perceiving this. And the people who are saying it are healthy-minded individuals. That's important. If you got a bunch of narcissists who are like, oh my God, I just don't like her because she doesn't tell me how great I am. Or she doesn't, you know, tell me about me and, you know, and it's always about everybody else. It's never about me. That's different. You know, you don't need to take that seriously. But, you know, if they're healthy minded people and they're saying, okay, something's going on here. And maybe you start to stop and go, you know what? I have been very sharp with my words. What is that? You know, it's a self-reflective kind of time. It's an insightful time for you, but you have to be willing to, to look at what's being presented to you. All right. It, it could be that kind of day. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.